need to look around the first floor. Classroom one! This blackboard belongs to us now! Sacred beauty. Just wanna see if I'd get lucky and there was a coin there that I hadn't searched for. Yeah, okay. I didn't figure, but... Uh, I, think I think that's Aoi. I think that's Aoi. That was Aoi Asahina. S someone come here! Yeah, there that we go. Hina. She's supposed to be checking the third floor. Okay, I was wondering. I flipped the stairs into the third floor. Right away, I started standing in the hallway. Please! M Makoto! You know what's wrong? It's awful! The rec room door was open! And when I looked inside, I... I saw... What do you see? I'd better get the others, right? I'm gonna go get them! You go on ahead, Makoto! So we weren't the one to discover the body, but we'll be the first one to... discover the body. Yeah. The rec room? What did she see in there? At this point, I used to... And I came without thinking, so without thinking, I left in the rec room. And it was just jizz everywhere. <laughs> well. The first thing I saw when I got in the rec room was... <sighs> it was Celeste and she was hurt. <sighs> Makoto! Celeste, what happened? I was stupid. Uh, I got... Yeah? Got attacked. attacked by who? I ain't sure. Some sort of strange man. Strange man? A suspicious person who existence is so unusual I can't help but call him strange. Is it the ghost of Leon? Without a doubt, it was some sort of strange, suspicious individual. And that's a sigh. And that man attacked me with that hammer on the ground there. Is this? What is this? It's some kind of wooden hammer, something pretty strange design. The Justice Hammer. I wonder who that could belong to. I wonder. There's some writing on the head. Justice Hammer 1? That's the hammer he attacked me with. I barely managed to avoid the blow, but I stumbled and fell. And that's how you got your face scruffed up? I now curse my lack of daily exercise. You were attacked with this? Justice Hammer 1. M Makoto! Celeste! That was one Okay. I found Sakura! <laughs> Celeste, what on earth happened here? Apparently she was attacked by some kind of strange man, an SSI. A strange man? Tell us everything you can remember, Celeste. Be as detailed as you can. <sighs> well, it all happened earlier this morning. I woke up a little before 7am. Night time was not over yet. But I knew it was about to end, so I decided it'd be okay if I... decided to take a little stroll around the first floor. I understand now that was a mistake. Anyway, that's where I first saw the strange man. I was immediately wary of him. He was obviously suspicious, so I decided to follow after him in secret. As I followed, I saw him go into the rec room and I tried to peek through the gap in the door. Which is when he noticed me and... And that's when you were attacked. It happened after 7am, just after night time it ended. So it happened just after 7 o'clock, a full hour <coughs> or so ago. Yeah. Thank you, sorry. I should have muted myself, fuck, I didn't even realize. Yeah. Then that was just about an hour ago, right? Right when we were all meeting in the dining hall. <sighs> the attack caused me to lose consciousness. As I'm the only actual man here, I am now acquitted, so we know it was one of the others. Which would mean I was unconscious for about an hour. 
Well, I'm just glad you weren't hurt too badly. That is because I begged and groveled for my life. You... you did? As for me... I told him I'd do anything if you spared me. I offered to lick his boots, whatever it took. So you, so you were willing to throw away all your pride? Indeed. It is a necessary skill for survival. Anyway, the important thing now is that we go search for the suspicious individual. If we do not hurry, this could become a serious problem. Celeste, what do you mean a serious problem? An SP. When I looked into the rec room, I saw that suspicious man was not alone. He had with him... He fooled me. Fumi. After he attacked me, he dragged Hifumi away. What? You mean Hifumi was kidnapped? Yeah, this story's bullshit. Dr the thought of anyone dragging Hifumi is just bullshit. Um... Lol. Shouldn't we start looking for him then? Listen, Celeste, did anything stand out about this strange guy? Anything in particular? <sighs> did anything stand out? Well... Rather than trying to explain it, it would probably be faster if I simply showed you. I have a photograph. Look at this graph. Show Indeed. us. This is Hifumi's hand-me-down, his digital camera. You don't mean... Actually. I was able to photograph the suspicious individual without him realizing it. Huh? Seriously? Let's see it! <laughs> I would tell you not to be shocked, but I fear it would do you no good. With that strange comment in mind, we all looked at the camera. Huh? This is a joke. <laughs> this looks... This is... This is a joke. What? Well, you were definitely right about the strange part. Their face is totally covered. Is that a robot costume? As I said, a very strange and suspicious individual, yes? So this weird robot guy dragged you through me away? And I took this right after being attacked. In other words, a full hour ago. Which is why, if we don't hurry, it could become a serious problem. I see. I believe I understand what happened. Well, no, there is much I don't understand, but... Hmm. The point is someone dressed like that dragged Fumi away. And that it... And it happened over an hour ago. Just a second! This is bad! We have to hurry! Celeste, do you know where this mysterious man went? Let's see. When they left the rec room, they headed left. I see. If that is true, then we headed toward the they were headed toward the stairs leading down to the second floor. Then he must be down there, right? Hmm. The second floor, that's where Kyoko was supposed to be. Speaking of which, why isn't Kyoko here? Um sorry, I didn't have time to go look for her. You made it all the way back to the dorms? Rather than checking the second floor. This is bad. This is bad. If the strange man did head to the second floor, Kyoko might run into him. We have to hurry. Kyoko's in danger. I'm in danger. As soon as the words were out of my mouth, we all rushed out of the room and down to the second floor. I think that's Biakia? Hey, you two. Ah, What's going on? What's right. all fuss? I wasn't sure which one of them it would be. Yeah, you guys playing a game or something? Murder. What are you saying? Does it freaking look like we're playing a game? Listen, have either of you seen Kyoko or Hifumi? No, no, sure happened. Are they on this floor? We just got here ourselves. I heard some kind of uproar, so I came running. We came here together. Stop talking. No, you're just stalking me. Anyway, can you guys help us look for them? Why? What happened? 
There's no time to explain. Now, nah, we'll explain later. That's fine. Well, fine. It looks like something interesting is going on. Okay. Hifumi! Kyoko! If you can hear me, say something! Her voice echoed down the hall in vain. Oh. Did... Did you hear something? Hmm. Maybe... Maybe... I think it came from the library. Okay. The library? Okay, let's go. We are in the library as fast as our legs would carry us. When we open the door of the library. Mm -hmm. It hurts. It hurts. We found a Fumi seriously injured. Are you okay? Um. I'm glad to see you're still alive. <laughs> it's super bad though, look at all the blood. What? How did you get hurt? <laughs> that guy hit me. What guy? <laughs> Robo Jester, sir, that's why I decided to call him just now. What did you say? <laughs> yeah, I'm just letting him say that. Another hammer? Whatever. Biakia, yeah, you're. I was trying to do that. Yucky, your thoughts on all this before we even get an explanation? What did you say? <laughs> okay. <laughs> that line's good. Yeah. That guy was Rebel Justice. Uh, this Robo Justice you're referring to, is this, is it not? What the hell am I looking at? This is the one that attacks Celeste and Fumi. Is that right, Fumi? <laughs> This is unforgivable! Rebel Justice? It can't be! Damn. This shit keeps getting stranger. Two. Justice Hammer 2, and on top of that, this one actually has a little bigger than the first one. Mm -hmm. Third one might actually kill someone. He attacked me with that hammer. He bunked me right on the head with it. Wow. Hammer that. A uh, hammer that big. I'm surprised you're still okay. <laughs> I'm not okay. Look at all this blood. Protein helps heal wounds, you know. Would you like some? <laughs> I have never heard such a thing. Are you sure it isn't just you? For a lot of justice, huh? Now things are really starting to get interesting. Exciting. What kind of special moves does it have? Can it fly? Can it combine? Can it combine with me? I'm gonna fuck the robot. <laughs> what? Why is he here? Are you okay with this? Let's not concern ourselves with him. Right, what we need to do now is get Hifumi to the nurse's office right away. Whatever else we do, he needs to be treated as soon as possible. Yeah. You're right. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Thanks, everyone. We moved Hifumi to the nurse's office on the first floor so we could take care of his injuries. How are you feeling, Hifumi? You want me to take a look at you? I'm okay. I think I stopped bleeding. I'm still kind of dizzy, though. So then. Perhaps you should rest here for a while. I suppose. Well, then. The rest of us should go back to looking for that mystery assailant. Yes, indeed. Before another victim appears. The justice hammer seems to be increasing in size. First one and now two. So in other words, there's the justice hammer three, we can only assume it's even bigger than the first two. If you got hit with anything bigger than that, you'd be dead for sure. Hmm. Tell us what happened to you, Hifumi. Well, I woke up early this morning and started looking for Alter Ego ahead of everyone else. 
I went to the third floor, and that's where the strange costume man attacked me. <sighs> that must be what I witnessed at around seven this morning. Well... After that, he dragged me to the library, and whack! Down came the hammer. That must have been 30 or 40 minutes ago. After that, I just kind of bled out until you guys found me. At around 7.30, in other words, we would have still been in the dining hall. Which means Hinasaka and I were together and Kyoko was still with us. So oh, we all have alibis. I was in the laundry room, doing my laundry. Can I have some change? Yes. His black underwear is black as the pitch black darkness of the blackest night! What? Why do you know that? <laughs> Isn't it obvious? Because I was peeking! Anyways, that means Biaki and Toko were together at the time. I mean, they also have allies that literally just leaves one person. Don't want you have been seen yet. Hero and Taka, that's it, right? Very strange. By the way, what happened to Kyoko? I haven't seen her anywhere. Um... Oh yeah, she was supposed to be checking the second floor, but I didn't see her up there at all. Where could she have disappeared to? Hmm. She just disappeared, huh? What a strange woman. So that's it. She might be exactly as I suspected. Hold on. Kiko was with us in the dining hall when Celeste and Hifumi were attacked, so... <laughs> I'm not talking about who attacked them. Huh? In other words... I'm referring to what she, we talked about last night. Who the mastermind spy might be. Are you saying Kyoko wor is working with the mastermind? That's not possible. I mean, it's the same conclusion I came to. What? Isn't it? This woman who seems almost eager to handle dead bodies hasn't even revealed her true identity. Hey. Save this discussion for later. Right now we need to focus on finding the suspicious individual. Okay. Yeah, if we don't hurry, there's only going to be more victims. That's That might be why Kyoko and Taka and Hiro haven't shown up yet. She's right. We have to do something about the, that mystery man first. Um, Don't worry about me. I'll catch up with you guys after I rest up a bit. <laughs> Understood. Take care of yourself. Well then. Okay, let's go. Hmm. So whoever is running around, why are they wearing that weird costume? <laughs> Don't bother looking for a reason from a deviant. What to do? So, what are we gonna do? Split up and look around? Huh. Our opponent is very dangerous. We don't know what they're capable of, even here. What? <clears throat> What's wrong? I saw a shadow! Something moving around at the top of the stairs! Huh? Really? Oh. Up on the second floor, then? Yeah. <laughs> You bastard, bre, you bre, won't bre. get away from me! Bre, 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 bre. We do not say bre, bre, bre. We all shot toward the stairs. He must be around here somewhere, let's split up and corner him! Well. But don't take any chances, as soon as you find him, call out and I'll come running. Oh. Okay. Okay, but what should we yell? Er, there, what? Anything, it doesn't matter! So then. then is ha okay? What are you saying? Ha or dia or whatever you want, just yell loud enough so we can hear you. <laughs> <laughs> Do ya? I've never heard such a reaction. Aww. Okay, whatever. Just hurry up and start looking, okay? Let's go. <laughs> hey, Mr. Robot, where are you hiding? If you don't come out, we're gonna decommission you. We sprout in every direction and track down the con costume suspect. I'm assuming it wouldn't be here, but I figure I would check. Yeah, I figured. That strange cry is definitely Celeste. It came from four above. She's on the third floor. Sprinted up to the third floor. Everyone. Over here, everyone! 
Everyone heard the screams Just come running. Celeste, what's wrong? What? That was a rather intense scream for someone like you. I saw him, that strange costume man. He ran off as soon as I screamed. I was blocking the stairs, so he headed further down into the hallway and disappeared. He must be down this hall. Come on, let's go. Mm -hmm. What is it now? Yeah, I thought so. Huh? 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 Whoa! It's really true! But that doesn't matter right now! That's a food. Uh huh? Yeah, I know. Well, what was that? That came from downstairs. It must have been. Fumi, he's in the nurse's office. That doesn't make any sense. This is bad. Come on, we have to go back. What about the suspect? We've gone to all this trouble to capture him, right? Then why don't we split into two groups? It's all clear now. I'll lead the hunting party. That seems much more interesting. So then. Very well, the Makoto and Hida, you come with me to the nurse's office. Wait, question. Who's doing the hunting party? Uh, if it's these three, then it's Byakuya, Sakura, and... Who else is here? I think that's it. So Byakuya and Sakura. Toko. And Toko, Toko, I guess. Okay. Yeah, I guess Sakura can handle it, but like... Yeah, we're not. <laughs> we're not... I will I leave guess, the capture of the suspicious yeah. individual to Toko, Sakura, and Byakuya. So we'll handle it. Just go take care of it for me. Okay, you guys be careful. That was split into two groups. Me, Celeste, and he all ran downstairs to the first floor. Just the weak people are down here. He's in the nurse's office. Okay. You pass it. You pass it. Oh, I thought it was right there. No, it's right there, the pink door. You pass yeah. again. Yeah, I did not pass it. I was right next to it. Oh, skipped it? He's got a brawny ass little leg. Everything is covered in pink. In the center of this, all this pink was. Fumi? It, it looks like something very bad has happened. I certainly was not expecting this. Considering we had everyone together except two people, that means one person's a robot costume, the other one smacking people with mallets. I should not imagine that Hifumi would be murdered. Oh, this is you. you. What? Oh. Yeah, didn't realize it. Hey, <laughs> murdered? You're not serious, are you? He's not really dead, is he? He's been discovered. A body has been discovered. After a certain amount of time, which you may use however you like, the class trial will begin. What, what the? There was the body discovery announcement. Body discovery announcement. When three more people discover a body after a murder, that's what place. And since we just heard it, that means... It must mean he found me. Someone killed him. One of us. One of us? And look at that. When Celeste said that, she pointed to something. Something on the floor. Something that had also been on the floor the last two surprise attacks. Was it the color pink? Yes, exactly. Another hammer. Justice Hammer 3. It is even bigger than the other two. If there's a four, it'll be the size of a person. Just as I suspected, one strike from that and you're finished. Then the killer. There can be no doubt this no. Then there can be no doubt the suspicious individual. Going by what Hifumi called him. The culprit must be Robo Justice. Whoever's hiding in that costume is the one that killed Fumi. But wait, you saw him on the third floor, right? Running back into the hall. 
So how did he end up in the nurse's office? You're not saying they like teleported or something, right? Are you okay with this? We can figure that part out later. Right now we have to tell the others. What's with this voice? It's definitely not Southern. You're right. Southern. It is. And shall we go? Is. It definitely is. Oh. Zero percent. It sounds like a disturbed alley. No, it's Southern. Tina, snap out of it! Huh? Are you okay, Hina? Oh, sorry. Sorry, I'm not sure I can move right now. I'm feeling kinda... This is a problem. We can't just leave Hina here alone. Okay, then I'll go get everyone. You stay here with Hina. Very well. I'll leave it to you, then. Okay, I'll be back soon. I tried to sound confident and upbeat, but I still hadn't stopped trembling for what I'd just been through. Everyone else is already on the third floor. I have to hurry. This is where everyone was chasing after the suspicious individual. Also, uh, just to be clear, right? Hmm? You can have two dead bodies, right? Up to. No more. Yes, yes I know. No. I just wanted to be sure. Yeah. So we're not safe at this point. Where was he no. headed? Technically not, I guess. Way into the back of the hallway. Alright. I guess it would be here. No. No. Oh, didn't even know this was an area back here. Forgot about it. Right. Physics room. Perfect for a robot. Makes sense. As far as I can tell, there's nobody here, but still I feel some kind of presence. Yeah, I'm sure I can feel someone's presence. This presence, is it coming from over there in the back? Right here? Mm-hmm. I always can't figure out whether something's a door or not a door. I leapt through the doorway, and when I did, I found another nightmare. The second nightmare of the day was waiting there to greet me. Okay, so that leaves one dickhead. There in a pool of his own blood was Taka dead. A next generation legend stand tall galactic hero. Thuma's body discovered in the nurse's office. Taka's body discovered in the equipment room. I was witness to two nightmares, one right after another. No, they weren't nightmares. This is harsh reality. The true nightmare is this reality, the reality I have to face every day. But still. Why is this happening? We should probably cut it here since we're in investigation now. Yep, I was about to say that. Guys. Hell yeah, beat you. Next time on Let's Play Dangan Yompa, we're gonna be doing the class trial. I called it last time that we should be nearing this and we never even got to do the owie stuff I wanted to do. Yeah, rip. It's a good we'll thing I it's a good thing I didn't say Hifumi or Taka. Yeah, that's why I was like, okay, good. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're solid. So I was worried you wanted to talk to Taka, because I know you like Taka. I do like Taka, but I wanted to talk to Aoi because I felt like a lot of shit's been going down and Aoi could use a hug to be honest. Also I so excited to see you see Taka die. Hell yeah. I was why the for it. Why? Because you liked him! Yeah, fuck you! <laughs> Dog and Rampa I is did. entirely about watching your favorites die. Also, get up. We know you're about to. Do the tongue thing. 